Friends, I'm so glad that you start another daily walk with God. And today it's the Reformation theme. So in Ephesians chapter 2 we hear, For by grace you have been saved through faith. And this is not of your own doing. It is a gift of God, not a result of works, so that no one may boast. You see, in October 31st in 1517, that was known as Reformation Day. And so we celebrate Reformation Day to this day, more than 500 years later. It began when Martin Luther nailed his list of 95 theses to the door of the All Saints Church in Wittenberg, Germany. You see, we can also hear about this same type of revival, which that's what the Reformation was about, in Psalm 85. We hear the call for revival of the Holy Spirit working in our individual hearts, bringing refreshment of the Lord's passion and zeal. Restore us again, God and Savior. Will you not revive us again that your people may rejoice in you? Show us your unfailing love and grant us your salvation. I will listen to what God the Lord says, and he promises peace to his people. You see, revival isn't just some sort of random burst of energy, but it's based on the truths found in the Bible. For Martin Luther and the Reformers, that was what the Reformation was all about. And it was based on five enduring principles. True Christian faith is based on Scripture alone, on salvation in Christ alone, by grace alone, through faith alone. And all of this is for the glory of God alone. You see, these points summarize the key principles of the Reformation. And we do good to remember those and live by them. Be a blessing. Go out and give them heaven, folks.